Koshal he shall at Apelidori Harka Lavrit Blinta and Noas, Agas is Marshin at Toshit, Satra and Aroch shall freshen, Agza Kit or Rahos Buntas Maacher and Nia Echeda, Togadur, your Konya Fotaku, Gudi shall freshen, Gohodia Thracian Halunchin, a Gunya Roscomon. Gonna eat out she spoke to a Nishna fan of the Rina, he and Agas Lashin Dun and Echter and Tabla, Vefa Sugme and Bua a Kirk and Dunosha. Economy had a great start to the league, a noteworthy seven points win over Mayo, but things got a little bit unpredictable after that. Is that testament to the quality of the league or what do you put the inconsistency down to? Yeah, um, look, the, there's no secret that the league is, is very competitive in Division 1 this year. Um, as you said, we had a, a great start with a, with a good win over Mayo and then unfortunately probably three defeats on the bounce to um, Donegal, uh, Roscommon and Dublin. And, uh, only last week then we had a good victory, a, a well-wanted victory against Man, and so um, we, f we find ourselves near the latter stages of the table, so we're looking for uh, another victory now, hopefully against down this weekend, and probably we'll need another victory away to carry just to, to keep ourselves safe, so I'd say it's very competitive in Division 1, and um, we're just looking forward to a good test now this weekend. No doubt that recent victory over Monaghan at home would have brought much relief. Is it a sign that you've turned a corner? Um, yeah, I think there's a lot of aspects of our game that we would have been happy with against Monaghan. Um, I think we worked worked hard all over the pitch, um, played good football, um, and as I say, we were, we were just delighted to, to get the victory. It was the one that we really needed because, as I say, we three three losses on the bounce, and, and we were just so I was glad to, to get another victory under our belt. And um, as I say, it was, it was very well needed just to, to keep our head above water. Keller and pass to come on, so does it? Come on, Neil. Bartish sticks the cool. A column O'Neill. That's probably one thing that Cooling probably stood out right. We have been maybe conceding a lot of scores while probably scoring um, good enough on the other side of the pitch. So I think in them games we probably just simply came on to work right. I don't think um, we were working hard enough all over the pitch. We weren't stopping the attacks and, uh, and we were leaving our, probably our defence a bit exposed. And in fairness, the, 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 the teams that we were playing like they're high quality teams. If you give, give teams like Roscommon, if you give teams like Dublin, uh, like Donegal, opportunities to, to take their scores, they'll punish every time. So um, I think we probably improved a bit against Manning, but um, as I said, there's a lot more work to be done and hopefully we can, we can tighten up again uh, this Sunday. The game against Down, it's an important one. A game at home against a team who are fighting to stave off relegation now at this stage. How important would a win be for Cork, particularly in terms of cementing the team in the top tier for next season? Yeah, it's it's a it's a huge game for us. Um, as I say, we, we were delighted with the win last last week against Monaghan, but we know we need another two points uh, this this weekend. To, as I say, to keep our head above water, um, it's 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 clear to see that the, the the bottom of the table is getting fairly congested, even around the middle. There's a lot of teams on the same points, so we'll be just hoping for hoping for a victory, um, and we'd probably need some other um, fixtures probably to go our way. Um, if we're to if we're to if we're to stay up and stay competitive and uh, make the latter stages of the league.